Hey, good evening, y'all. It's Anthony. Alright, so I just got back to the apartment from working out and talking to my brother at my mom's house. And I was listening to some stuff during my workout, like always. Got like podcasts. You know, like growing and educating myself. But, uh, I think it's, um, a Real Estate Millionaire is a podcast I'm listening to right now, or not a podcast, but a book I'm listening to. And it talks about the difference between an investor and a consumer. That's probably why most people don't have wealth in this world. They are consumers. They're spending money to get the stuff that's not adding to their net worth. It's not an asset. It's not producing cash flow. You don't want to be a consumer, y'all. That's why when I consume, I consume using stash. Because every time I swipe my stash debit card... I get stock back. So in a sense, I'm consuming everyday products. I got the gas station, Walmart, wherever. Plus, I'm investing in the stocks and the create financial freedom. I'll add a link to the Stash app in the description of the video, but like I said, if you want to attain financial freedom, stop being a consumer. Stop spending your money on stuff that's not adding to your network, not adding to your cash flow, not adding to your value in life. And start becoming an investor. And investing for your future. Well, that's it. I don't care what you want to do. You're never going to earn your way to financial freedom. A lot of celebrities do it. Then they go broke when the income stops coming in. You want to create up income streams that are coming in whether you work or not. It's called passive income. How do you do that? Become an investor. Invest in monthly, quarterly, or whatever passive income streams. Like, it, it's nice to get money that you don't actually have to work for. Like I said, my goal is not to earn a crap load of money. I live now probably off earning between three and six hundred dollars a week. Usually closer to three. I think last week I made like a little over two hundred. Well, I said, I'm not trying to earn a crap load of money. Minimize your expenses. But the more money I do earn, the more money I can invest. So always, I don't believe in a budget. I don't like budgets, but you need to budget your money. The first thing I pay, my, I pay is myself. And they're going to be in an apartment. First thing I do is I pay myself 20, 25% of whatever my take-home income is. My earned income. Then I have my investments on automation. So every month I got a couple hundred bucks going into my re, a couple hundred bucks going into my Roth IRAs. Why? Because I like investing. The more investments you make, the more assets you accumulate, the higher your net worth will be, and the easier it will be to attain financial freedom. So again, at the end of the day, I'll stop being a consumer and start becoming an investor. And if you're getting some sort of value from any of my videos, hey, let me know. Subscribe to my channel. And let's get this um, word out to everyone in the world to stop being a consumer. To start being an investor. And start going after financial freedom. Because I don't care who you are. You go out to anyone on the street and ask them, do you want me worth it? But yeah, they don't know how to do it. They think they gotta earn a lot of money. That's not the way to do it. You gotta become an investor. Accumulate assets. Stack up your assets. Increase your net worth. And create financial freedom. Dividends are lovely. Positive capital is lovely. At the end of the day, money you don't have to work for is just lovely. But again, just you're out of my channel, hit the like button. I don't know what the hell this dude's doing in the parking lot. But whatever, I'm going to go eat my potato. Have a good night, y'all.